This is one of the most beautiful and cleanest beaches in the world. And if you head hundreds of kilometers through this beach towards the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, you would think twice before stepping your foot even on the cleanest beaches. According to the November 2021 report, around 14 million tons of plastic dive into the oceans every year, contributing towards around 80% of the marine debris. Thankfully, the Maldives is not affected by this massive pile of garbage, but if no one is ready to take action, then the time is not too far when we would be taking photos of garbage on every beach around the world. But before we lose hope in cleaning up the massive oceans, there is one company that is not ready to give up. You research, you test, you sometimes fail, and then you learn and you repeat until you make it work. This is Boyan Slot, the CEO and the founder of one of the most hardcore companies called The Ocean Cleanup, who is proving his belief to the world with his undying spirit to clean the oceans. Their plan is to clean 90% of the ocean plastic pollution and 80% of the riverine trash that is finding its way to the oceans from 1,000 rivers worldwide. So how are they achieving this massive task? Let's find out. The project simply begins by creating a 600-meter long floater and a 3-meter deep net attached below the floater in areas where an excess amount of plastic has been identified. The floater is packed with a barrier that prevents any form of debris or plastic from flowing above it, and the skirt is designed in a way that prevents any particles from escaping through it. To ensure no marine animal gets caught up inside the net, the skirt intentionally creates a downward flow to help them pass safely below it. So how does this project manage to carry the massive amount of ocean debris? Well, it intentionally uses the natural powers of wind, currents, and waves. Current takes care of catching the plastic materials beneath the water, while wind and waves play their own part in catching more debris along the system. If you look closely at the U-shape created by the project, it is caused by a sweet pressure imposed by the current at the center of the skirt, which is extended more than its edges, thus making it easier to grab marine debris at the center. To navigate more easily as per the change in the direction of the wind, the drag created by the skirt at the center automatically helps in this purpose. The system is also packed with a solar-powered light, sensors, cameras, anti-collision mechanism, and satellite antennas that help in gathering data and performance index of the system by also sending the data from the connected satellite to the designated team. In the end, a pickup truck awaits to pick up the collected debris by the system, which delivers it to the recycled plants where the debris is converted into durable products like a watch, bags, and anything that could be used by the public. As the Great Pacific Garbage Patch, located between the waters of California and Hawaii, is considered as the father of most of the marine debris, the project is currently deployed there. Not to forget, this is one of the 60 projects which the Ocean Cleanup Company is planning to deploy. Despite focusing on cleaning the oceans, Ocean Cleanup Company also conducts research on an everyday basis to find out the main causes of such enormous marine debris. Some of their astonishing findings include the June 2017 report, which discovered that around 80% of the marine debris is coming from the rivers in Asia. That's why the ocean cleanup has managed to deploy river interceptors all around the world, helping the rivers to rid of the plastic waste before they find their way to the ocean. Another staggering report of October 2019 declares that most of the ocean plastic pollution is coming from Chinese cargo ships. By keeping in mind all the contributions from this company, it has also managed to influence other players to give support in cleaning our precious oceans. For example, for Ocean. If the Ocean Cleanup Company focuses on cleaning the marine population by jumping at the center of the ocean, Four Ocean, on the other hand, takes care of cleaning marine population in the coastal areas. With its amazing social media marketing skills, the company has managed to spread awareness amongst people around the world in a very short period of time. To run their projects around the world, this South Florida-based company is completely dependent upon selling bracelets made from recycled ocean plastic waste. The Ocean Conservancy 
One of the most striking features of this American-based nonprofit company is that it loves holding an international event on cleaning the coastal areas, which automatically attracts people around the world to clean up the coastal areas of their country. To contribute further, the company also collects data to find out what is actually causing pollution in the oceans. Surprisingly, cigarette butts, food wrappers, and straws were considered some of the top three items that were collected on a massive level. So this is how the Ocean Cleanup Company is creating a breakthrough in cleaning our oceans. It is true that the giant size of the ocean could make this project look smaller, but if more companies like 4Ocean and the Ocean Conservancy could join hands together, then we are soon going to clean our oceans from the roots and could also save millions of marine life every day. So, what do you think about this amazing ocean cleanup project? Do you think we can now clean the oceans completely? Tell us in the comment section below, and if you have any questions or suggestions, then feel free to mention them in the comment section and we will surely respond to your request. Thank you so much for watching.